What's up everybody, welcome back to Case Digital, my name is Zach, and in today's video we are answering the question of how to get the current time in Python. We're gonna cover which module or modules you may use and how you can essentially go about getting the time. So let's hop right in and start talking about the packages that you'll need to help you get the time in Python. So I'm gonna show you the easiest way that you can get the time and the packages that you're gonna to need to do this is essentially the date time package. Now, to get the date time package, you don't need to pip install anything. The reason being is it's part of the Python um, built-in libraries. And so all you need to do is just import it so to do so we're gonna say from and I'm gonna say from because you can do this two ways you can do this just import date time date time just like that um, got spelled right first so you can do it just like that but then you have to do some other um, things like date time date time if you want to use it to avoid some of that I always kind of just tend to do something like from date time and we're going to use the date time package within date the the date time um, or the date time module within the date time package. So essentially, this is the line to get everything going. So now, how do we use it? So now that we have that imported, um, basically it comes down to the one liner that you can use to get the time in Python. Um, I really like the date time package because it's I use it actually a lot in what I do. Um, there are other other ways to get the date time, but I feel like this is the best. And to do so, all you're going to say, and we're just going to print this out. So we're going to say print, and then we're going to run um, date time date time dot now now this is a function and just as you see it'll basically um, construct the date time from the time dot time so time dot time is basically it'll give you as a inner fun Python function it'll essentially give you um, the current time in um, seconds based off the epic and then what this does is format it nicely so if we run this say Python how to get the current time of Python we run this we're essentially gonna see, there it is. There is the date, so the year, the month, the day, and the current time, so there's our time. But what if we just want just the time? So how do we go about doing that? So if we just wanted the time out of our date time now function, there are some like string, for, like some date time string formatting stuff that you could do to get just the time, but there is also an additional function. So if I, um, cause this will basically give us the full date time. So we could create a variable called date time um, and maybe let's just do that. So we can say date time, her day time is equal to that, but there's an additional function that off of that. So now cur date time should be this date time object that holds everything. I can just say cur date time dot time. And then I could print this, I could then print this out, right? So if we go print that out, you see, we now just get the time. And granted, I could do this in one line by essentially just doing this. But sometimes, you know, variables are helpful to do what you want. But if I just run this, we get the same answer of just our current date time. So I hope you found this helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. And until next time, keep on programming.